Okay, today I'm gonna teach you about dungeon aggro, the mobs, how they attack you, and what you should have to resist more from their attack. The first thing is always drink magic resist potion, the greater one. It will give you, I think, 25% of resistance. This is the icon that lights when it's activated. Another thing, you have to have war aspect or void aspect. Those are the best. At least tier 15, uh, sorry, tier 10. Uh, if you have less, you won't resist much and you have to heal yourself a lot. And the third thing is always build your PK if you're gonna create one in the same account as your PvP because you can open the links and for PvP you can add damage resist uh, until 10 links and then you can add spell damage resistance from 11 to 12 to 20 and uh, I'm gonna teach you now how the aggro works uh, every time you see a mob or the mob sees you, you have two seconds until it aggroes you. So one, two, and boom, they are after me. Why is this important? Because if you are running, let's pretend there's something, there's somebody here, uh, north, and I'm aggroing the mobs. If he's after me, I can double teleport and they will get by the mobs. You'll get attacked and he'll probably die if it's your friend you, all you have to do is and you are more resistant you can aggro and hold so he can go in front of you or if it's an enemy like i said you just teleport and rope and the aggro will turn to him and then you can eb and drop and kill him that's it and another important thing, of course, is drink strength potion, drink heal potion, and stamina, and all those things. Um, it's good to have protection, and you can have this kind of message. This is called overhead message that I set for myself, so you can know when it's ending without you paying attention to the bar. But I'll teach this in another video. And that's it. Hope you like it.